Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about the VMware Workstation drag and drop folder that's located on your virtual machines. So what this is used for, so let's say you copy some files from your host to your VM, it'll put them in this temporary file location, and then once everything's copied over from the host, it'll move them to the location you wanted to copy them to. So let's say you drag some files to the desktop, and you'll see that green bar go across and you kind of locked out of your uh, VMware Workstation until it's finished. So what it's doing is copying to that folder, and then it'll move them to the desktop once it's copied. But sometimes the copy fails or it never finishes, and then you have to do it again, or even if, you, even if it does finish, it might leave some leftover folders. So we're gonna show you how to find those and clean it up and get some of your space back. So the location of this folder is under username. So user, username, app data, local temp, VMware slash username, and then VMware DND, drag and drop. And so there's these random names here sorted by a date and you could open it up and see what's in them. So like this, for example, was one that failed. It didn't make it to the desktop when I copied it. And uh, I wondered what happened. So I went to the folder and it was here. So it just didn't make it out of the temporary folder, even though it copied over. And then we have this one here. This one I just did for a test here, copied it over. And the files are still there, even though they did make them to where I copied them over to. So it's a duplicate set here. And then we have this other one, which it has the leftover folders, but the files were taken out of it. So it kind of partially cleared it out when it was done. So what you could do, if you want to get your space back, you could, all you need to do is go to this folder, highlight these uh, folders inside VMware D and D, and just delete them. So right now I have 5.6 gigabytes of space I could get back. So if I just, once I'm sure that they, you know, I don't need the stuff from there and they've been, you know, copied over to the proper location, I could just do a shift delete. And now that's cleared out. And so I'm back in business and I just got my space back. And so that's just one way to clear up a uh, space on your virtual machine. You could also uh, clear up space on your host by clearing out files from there as well that are actually deleted from the virtual machine but still technically taking up space on the VM or I should say in your VMDK file. So we have a video for that and I'll put that in the description so you can check that out as well so you can get some space back on your host at the same time. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.